Hi, I'm so happy to see you. I'm Shamapti and so good to have you here. In today's video, I'm going to talk about how I treat my breakouts because I received many questions regarding this. So I hope my experience helps you out. So what I have mostly skin reaction from products or if I'm going somewhere, the weather is not suiting me, I get pimples, whiteheads. There are a few things that really help me out. First is clay mask. I love clay mask. I like bentonite clay, kaolin clay. Don't use these things every day. I say twice in a week or thrice in a week max when you're having breakout. Also, there are like clay masks from this brand, Dr. Sage. They have mandelic clay mask one sulfur clay mask i think sulfur one works better for breakouts and the manlic one works better for textures number two would be niacinamide niacinamide is multitasking it works on broken skin barrier it also helps to regulate oil production it also brightens up the skin even of the skin tone it works on breakouts see i told you this is multitasking and i have noticed when i have breakouts i need at least something with niacinamide but you have to note this thing there are people who are allergic to niacinamide so make sure you're not allergic to this ingredient also I like licorice this is very soothing as well i love this licorice mask that i make number three would be exfoliants chemical exfoliant can be your best friend so if you have breakouts like if you have pimples try bha like salicylic acid and if you have whiteheads textures try aha like glycolic acid lactic acid mandelic acid I use exfoliants twice or twice in a way but sometimes if your skin barrier is broken then do not use exfoliants for some time because your skin needs really gentle skin care during that time so if you don't know how to detect if your skin is just breaking out or if your skin barrier is damaged let me know i'm gonna make a video on it also i have to tell you exfoliants can make your skin extra photosensitive so make sure you're using sunscreen properly then what helps me out is spot treatments i have one from mario betisku and also pimple patches so lately i tried this huge pimple patch on my skin it didn't do anything good it made my skin irritated so I, i'm gonna stick to small pimple patches don't try to poke or scratch but i have noticed even if not poking or scratching uh, they leave pigmentation behind and for that that is another story i have to use that beauty and one day i have this very good skin next day my skin had this allergic reaction so i have to start again uh, then i have gonna have this pigmentation from this allergic reaction i have to treat it then uh, my skin is gonna get better then again one day it's gonna like <laughs> it can be tiring the water you use to wash your face check the ph of that water if the water you're using is too alkaline i have lived in a place that had water that had ph around 9 to 10 that can contribute to your skin problem also check your pillowcase make sure your pillowcase is not dirty i'm gonna remind you many more times because these are the minute things people forget like dirty mobile skin uh, 30 pillowcase make sure your hair products are not reaching to your cheeks if you're using too many styling things for your hair and if your hair is constantly touching your cheek then it can create trouble also sika creams they help me a lot to soothe the skin also if i have too much whitehead i try to use light skincare products because when i already have too many uh, whiteheads that time you know even a little bit of heavy skincare can cause me trouble it does to me i try to use things that don't have too much occlusives personally when i get too many whiteheads if a product has too much of occlusive that sometimes create trouble for me otherwise occlusive they do wonders to my skin they are very good to prevent the water loss you gotta have patience because everyone's skin is different so healing timing would be different and if you think you need professional help then go for a dermatologist and thank you so much for being there i hope you found this to be helpful and if i missed anything or if you want to ask me any questions let me know in the comments box i'll see you very soon then bye bye